My name is Xu Zhu Wang. Um, I'm a Portland artist. I was originally born and raised in Taiwan, but I've been in um, the U.S. since 1975. I've been making art uh, full time since 2000, and before that, um, I, you know, I've I've drawn and uh, painted and, and done photography for a long time. This piece, the Laundry Maze, is actually my first installation, but um, I also think it's a continuation of my work in book arts. I think it's, uh, it's, I think of it and I describe it to people as a very big book and I have been working with books uh, for about 12, 13 years. Inspiration for this piece, um, you know, I'm, I'm an immigrant myself even though I've been here for so long um, and I'm interested in the stories of other immigrants. The laundry business is very stereotyped, um, you can say iconic of the Chinese immigration experience. You know, the Chinese people came, they worked on the railroads they opened um, laundries. My grandfather um, immigrated from the mainland, uh, from the mainland, mainland China, to Taiwan, and that's where he met my grandmother, and they married. And after they married, they had a variety of businesses, and none of them really succeeded until they opened a laundry and a dry cleaner. And uh, by the time I came along, that was a very successful business. And um, so they had a, a, a two-story house where the uh, family lived upstairs and the downstairs, um, the, the ground floor was the business. And um, there was a, a storage room where all the clean clothes would hang. And my sister and I, as little kids, would go up there and play hide and seek. And so I, I had always wanted to do something with that idea and I, and I took the two. Um, with, the, with the idea of telling the stories of immigrants and, and their public identities, um, i.e. their jobs, their professions. I, I combined that with the idea of, of uh, the maze, the laundry as maze, and created this piece. Traditionally, nations were divided by um, mountain peaks or deserts, uh, rivers, oceans, um, and that's, that's what the, what's painted on the back, backs of the shirts. Um, in some ways, when you immigrate, you're kind of leaving the landscape of your home behind. The tags on the shirts are um, uh, people's professions before they immigrated and after they immigrated. And to me, they read like pages in a book. When I started the, the project, I had a very, I had, I had this preconception. And that was that people, um, when they come here, they usually have to take a lower paying job, a lower status job. But while that was true in some cases, um, that wasn't always true. Being in, a, in, a, in the lobby of an office building, um, I think it does bring different types of experiences. There's a group of kids that came in here and, and they had a ball. Um, they were just running around in here and, and that was great. Um, and I think that's an experience that's, experience that's very difficult to, to have in a gallery setting or in a museum setting. Yeah. Making art is about ideas, and then you try to find the best medium to express that idea. In this case, it was clear that I had to do, an, that the installation was the perfect medium. This is a public building. Um, it's in the lobby. It's public art.